Hey, how's it going YouTube? In today's video, I'm going to show you guys how to install a printer that's on your network. Um, how to install it on Windows 10. Uh, now, this is a similar process if you're already using Windows 8 or Windows 7. It's a similar process, so I'll show you guys how to do that. First thing you want to do is you want to open up your control panel. Uh, one way, to, I have the icon here on my desktop if you want to know how to do that you can watch my previous video another way to go to your control panel is you can right click the start button down here and then go to control panel and then from here you can click on the view devices and printers link that's right here um, if your control panel doesn't look like this and if it looks like this uh, again you can also click on the devices and printers right here so that's the one you want to look for and you can click on that and then it'll open and show you all the devices and printers that your computer currently has now in my case it doesn't have the printer that I want to install so right here I have my keyboard mouse speakers everything else is here but it doesn't have the printer that I want so what I'm going to do, what you want to do on your computer is click add a printer and it'll automatically scan your network so th again this is how to add a printer that's already on your network it could be through Wi-Fi or it could be, be through uh, Ethernet cable, LAN, it could be on the LAN so automatically your computer should detect it and once it detects that you can choose the printer that you want and then click next and from here you'll see, it'll, you'll see that it says it's installing the printer. Again, you want to make sure that your printer is on the same network as your computer, as this computer that you want to add it on. And then once it's done, it says you've success, success, successfully added the printer uh, to your computer. It says the name of the printer. You can select print a test page. So I'm going to do that here just to make sure that it prints a test page from my computer to my printer and yep it's printing perfectly fine I can hear it and you can see the page coming out and after that you can just click finish and that's it you'll see that you now have your printer here on your uh, devices and printers list and uh, if you want you can just go ahead right click and select set as default so to make sure that uh, setting this printer as default means windows will stop managing your default printer okay, okay and yeah you'll see a green check mark that means every time you want to print it'll always have this printer selected so it's uh, for ease of use so i hope this video got, helped you guys out thank you guys for watching please don't forget to comment rate and subscribe and uh, let me know if you have any uh, other ideas for future videos thanks guys and take care and then you'll see that it appears on your desktop Additionally, you can also enable the control panel, user files, network, all these icons you can enable so that it's on your desktop.